we first started uh, when a widow in town, her husband had been a professional photographer, and she came to me and said, hey, she wanted to sell these pictures because she needed a little bit of money to bury her husband. We estimate realistically that we have 100,000 that we've actually digitized already. We did the math one day. If somebody looked at all the pictures we've digitized so far, and if you spent three seconds on every picture, and you work 24 hours a day, seven days a week, looking at picture after picture after picture after picture, I think it would take you like five months or something to go through them all. <laughs> it's a bunch, it's a lot. My mother kept a family scrapbook for every year. And I learned as a kid to appreciate pictures, I guess, in part, because my mom doing all that wonderful scrapbooking. We're not owned by the city, we're not owned by the county, we're not owned by a university system library. We are independent. On the one hand, we wish we had some of their money, but on the other hand, we can stop everything we're doing and focus on something now, if there's a fresh new thing that's necessary. And I like that. So I guess my hope is that we'd always remain well supported, but independent and responsive to the flow of history and preserving it in Plant City.